Welcome back to the Retro Sports Gamer. It's your boy Green Magic. Uh, doing something a little different. I am recording a video instead of going live. Um, yeah. I think I need an update or something. The stream isn't uh, the stream feature isn't working for me, so we're gonna record, put this up later. And uh hope everyone's having a good day when they watch this. So I've had a thought for a little while, an idea of playing some Tecmo, go figure, but kind of putting a constraint on myself. Um, as you can see in the description, I thought I'd try Packers season, but no starters, um, no offensive starters. Not that the Packers are amazing to begin with, uh, but they do have the, the fun combo, Mikowski and uh, Sharp, which can be pretty deadly. And then they got Woodside, who's 44 max speed, which is about average, um, uh, but it's not terrible. And that's kind of uh, usually all I really ask for um, with a uh, with the running back. Um, we'll put in the backup, Daryl Thompson. It's 38 max speed. Not great, but that's that's what you get if your team's like the Steelers. So that's something I'm familiar with. Um, put in my backup tight end as fullback. A little blocking. And a tight end, uh, Fontenot, who often I put as my starting tight end uh, and for the Packers anyway. He's got that 38 reception, which isn't amazing, but he can sometimes pull one down for you. Um... I definitely don't like um, trusting receivers with less than a 38 reception, but 38 I can make work. Uh, then we got Jeff Query, who's actually the same attributes as Perry Kemp, so he's like my second wide receiver, but he gets the nod to go to first wide receiver. Charles Wilson, who uh, was the kick returner, um, but we're going to put him at second wide receiver. And then uh, Harris as my return is. Um, I thought about it. I think I'm going to go ahead and keep the default playbook. Ooh, looks like I got a different kind of playbook. That's interesting. Huh. So not a great playbook for the Packers. Um, this is a really poor play. This run to... Because it uh, it coincides with the reverse, the wide receiver reverse, and so it's very slow developing. It's a pitch L fake, <laughs> so he fake hands it off and then gets going. Um, you know, there's a time and a place for a wide receiver reverse, but only if you got a really fast, um, only f if you got a really fast. Wide receiver, um, like Washington or maybe the Oilers, have seen Tom use that to some success. Uh, but that's not the re not that's not the reverse you want. And uh, that's a this is a pretty slow developing play. Ooh, I realize that um, Harris is actually a tight end, so technically he's not supposed to be taking the handoff, but. He's, I think he's a 25 max speed, and that would that would never be uh, considered illegal, I think, in uh, any sort of, uh, you know, competitive Tecmo play. Uh, this is actually a, a great play, the red gun. You got a tight end going deep up top, so that's going to be Fontenot. Wide receiver two going deep. Of course, you got the man across the middle. You got the half back check down option. Um which is going to be Thompson. Thompson's only 19 uh, reception rating, so that's not too um, trustworthy. But, you know, we'll probably, especially on called plays, we might try to check it down to him a little bit. Great shotgun play, great for going deep. Also got a couple check down options. Um, people sleep on the one back flare A play. Um, it has a nice timed JJ route. If you want up top, um, and also has a blocker for you, the um, yeah, 
first running back, I believe, is your blocker. And uh, then your second, no, your your tight end is your other blocker, and I believe it's your second halfback that is the guy that goes across the middle. And then we got the, uh, the play action, very slow developing, um, but you do got a guy going deep and against, you know, the computer, which is what this playthrough is going to be. Um, it's not an absolutely worthless play. Um, so anyway, that's the Packers playbook. We've got about <laughs> one useful running play and three useful passing plays. And uh, we'll see what kind of nonsense we can get into. Um, we're going to skip it all the way. Uh, team control, we got Packers. We're going to start this. Um, Eagles a good team, but, you know, they're, it's pretty easy to, um, you know, take care of computer teams for the first four weeks or so. After you get 4-0, oh, um, oh, I got my controller in the wrong slot. That's hilarious. After your 4-0, oh, that's when the handicap kicks in. Um and stuff gets incrementally more difficult. Um, I always like to kick off. Um, it seems like, uh, you know, it's good luck. So, I'm gonna not worry about the other team's playbooks. Some teams have terrible playbooks, uh, and I'll just abuse them. Well, not really. What uh, another contingent I'm going to do is... Uh, I just thought of this. <laughs> I'm going to pick run one every play for the whole season, and um, I'm going to be Mark Murphy on every single play on defense. Ooh, terrible defense. Oh, that's going to be close to a touchdown. Ooh. So that's going to happen a lot, obviously. Going to get guys open like that. Ooh, could have been picked, actually. Because I think that was... Actually, it was probably Jackson over the middle. Had it been Sherman. Um, yeah, that would have been... Oh, Murphy! Oh no! That's bad luck. Great, uh, great fumble force by Murphy. Just a hard hitting. But uh, Keith Byers is there. That's just bad luck. Um, you know that's not not something to be sad about. The real faux pas was giving up that huge plate up on that. All right, so. Might as well try to get a decent run back here. Um, now I'll go ahead and go go shotgun with, with Dilly. Oh, and we got we got an opportunity for Query uh, wide open. Oh, buddy, boinks it. You know, Sterling Sharp definitely would have come down with that. Um, that's a. Uh, And I was locked in there, so I didn't get the first down. Uh, I'm going to pick pass two because if it's called, I can maybe slip it in there to, uh, oh, and there's the Jage. Um, Query was about to do his little curl route, and if you pass it, you know, a frame or three before. He does the curl route, a lot of times he'll get a JJ connection. So, first touchdown of many for Query. Um, hopefully it's a, a 50 tutter season, you know. You know de depending on conditions, I'll probably, you know, probably use some other guys at that, uh, that wide receiver one position. Nice check down to Byers, except he gets caught in the, in the Triz Ash. 
one reason I uh, pick Run 1 a lot, besides it's just a fun sort of... Ooh, that could have been picked. Um, it's a fun constraint to put on myself. It actually does give me half-decent coverage on defense. Or at least one guy back. Ooh, terrible defense. This is going to take a minute to get used to, but it's all good. Um, I did have one guy back there. I mean, he, he didn't help out really. Chuck Cecil. Um, I'm going to block one of these one day, for sure. Cecil did not uh, do Jack Diddley on that play, but sometimes drones accidentally oh, couldn't get around it. Sometimes drones accidentally get in the right place, so everyone's an average. So that's fine. We're going to go and do this run too. We probably won't be able to to do this many times uh, as the season progresses, so might as well get some reps in while, you know, the computer doesn't have a huge handicap. All right, and I see Fontenot, I see you, buddy, uh, gets the diver. Ooh, look at those eagles, look at them. The last second, I decided not to go out of bounds and to try to get the tutter. And uh, there we go. You want to spread the love around, you know. Uh, that is that is something you want to get out of this red gun play. You want to... A lot of times, the tight end is just wide open on the low route. Alright, let's see if I can play some defense. <laughs> Haven't done it yet. Of course, the Eagles, in my opinion, have the best offense in the game, thanks to Randall. But, the computer doesn't know that. They're just talking and chucking. Oh! And I do like to challenge myself to go for the divers, which isn't very... doesn't look disciplined, but... It's a very useful skill to practice. It can be very costly if you miss a diver. Oh, another one. In a you know man versus man match, but oh, and I missed it. Let's try to get under it. Yet another touchdown! Wow. I'll get there eventually. A little rusty. Not used to playing with you know freaking Mark Murphy back there, but uh. It is chill. I should be able to score on command, so... As long as I get the ball last, pretty much. Let's go ahead and uh, run for... Jackie. Ooh, no speed to speak of. Can't really get around that one. That's block, and that might have been picked. Well, there's Andre Waters back there, so probably wouldn't have been. I'm gonna go ahead and pass three, and if it's called, I can. Um, got him on the diver, nice. If it was called, you can sometimes get a, a time JJ route to the second wide receiver. I don't know how good Charles Wilson is gonna be. I don't know if there's gonna be much connection. Um, he does a 50 reception rating, which is average, so he probably won't jump and miss it. Then again, I, I got Dilly. Dilly Dilly throwing to him, so there's no talent, but... seconds and a half. I might just go ahead and try to get a cheap little, little safety here. Seeing as... Oh. Seeing as they're just not quite fast enough to really threaten... I don't know. There's the half. Good half, computer. Of 
course, I kicked off in the first half, so I'll get it now. Just gotta put my... Keep my foot on the gas. Ooh, Ruza getting in there. Dilly, still average. Ooh, we got a good Wilson, 31.56. So uh, I'm gonna go ahead and uh, put him at wide receiver one and see what, what he's good for. <laughs> one of the fun things about playing with the scrubs is you get excited about a 56. I uh, wanted the jumper, but you get excited about the 56 reception rating, which is, you know, like, not particularly good. But for my situation, it's, it's really good. <clears throat> now I'm in the driver's seat for the game. I just really just need one stop. Not too worried about it. Love me the Eagles, but... They're just not... Oh, Kenny Jackson goes down. Not proud of it, but that was Chris Jackie, the kicker, on the coverage there. Um, hit him with the diver. You know, probably didn't influence anything, but... Yeah, gets him with the diver. Nice, Cecil, and I guess uh, he's the top. Oh, whoops! I didn't uh, didn't pick it in time. I just had a feeling he might check it down. I didn't know. If, I didn't know if Cecil was gonna get over there in time, so I went ahead and covered. Um, yeah, it was a complete accident that I was brown. A big stop for the Packers. Uh, definitely one to. Definitely want to get another tutter and just put that put that distance between us. Ah, yeah, just no no speed. At least I didn't fumble it. That was a bad pass. I was trying to create a, a JJ situation. Ooh. Screw it, you know, I'm, I'm going for it. I got that, I got that one touchdown lead. Um. Oh, and the doinker. Yeah, that's why you gotta that's why you gotta convert before third down, you know? Ooh, covered catch. I think that's. I keep forgetting if it's. Holmes. Or Lee. Mark Lee or Jerry Holmes. One of them only has a 38. Uh, oh, good David. One of them only has a 38 interception rating. Ooh, another forced fumble. Wow. I was really tempted to go for the diver. But, you know, a missed dive might have... Not, not terribly smart, but it, it felt pretty, it looked pretty. I'm just gonna get out of bounds. And that's one of the things that plays great for the check down. So Daly, you rarely see him play in real games, but he's just got that middle of the road attributes. We're going for the home run here. He's got the middle of the road attributes, 44 speed, 38 reception that you'll just, you'll get some JJs. Um, and Fontenot, 38 max speed, 38 reception, just pulling down that JJ. So, 
I guess what I'm getting at is some of the other middle of the road quarterbacks, and there are many middle of the road quarterbacks in Tecmo. If you're talking about you're talking about some teams' starters and many many teams' backups are just it's the same guy basically 44 38 or 38 44. But the 44 speed is nice because it gets obviously a little more zip. So, like if you're checking it down to Fontenot like that, or you know who, or it wasn't Fontenot, it was a uh, freaking defense. Thompson, uh, checking it down to Thompson and. Ooh, Calvin. He's got some. He's got a CC or two, but not there. I just got to cover deep. Oh, I had a feeling he was gonna get that. Um, nice play, nice play. Anyway, 44 speed. Sometimes you can you can get that zip in there um, for the fat quick check down. Whereas with the 38 speed, uh, it's just it's just riskier. So, two touchdown lead. You know, Eagles should be taking shots for the end zone. Oh, and I was too slow. Uh, misjudged the angle. I wanted to get into that gap so I could knock it down. Uh, but, you know, better, better now than in real competition, you know. That pretty much ices the game right there. It's, it's, it's a two-score game now. Um, I think I'm just going to walk around a little bit. I can't fumble since it's... Oh! Since it's an onside, I, I can't fumble. So, uh... I was just walking around. Alright, they're going to give me a clean shot. Uh, this is just great practice. Uh, it looks random. It kind of is. Ooh, overthrown. We're gonna go another shotgun. But this is this is a huge, huge skill uh, that you need to be com to be competitive in Tecmo. Um, ooh, and that's just bad luck. He he could have jumped, but he didn't because it's lazy. Uh, but it doesn't matter. So, uh, yeah, QB Eagles, lots of, <laughs> lots of yards. Um, that fumble, though, was it just one? Yeah. The fumble on the goal line was kind of the difference in the game. Um, Fontenot, two big, deep catches. Pretty Barnett getting some yards. Shermanator, 43 yards. Really? I guess I missed a dive or something, but... Huh. Anyway, only one first down. That's funny. Um, let's go ahead and rip on to the next game. Um, so, the... The player attributes... Conditions. The player conditions don't change from the fourth quarter of a previous game to the first quarter of the next game. So I don't have to check my guys. I'm just gonna leave, I know that Charles Wilson's in good, and uh, everybody else is an average. Um, I'm not particularly looking forward to, to Anthony Dillwig going in bad, which is obviously gonna happen at some point. Um, The Lions. Uh, you got to be a little careful with Barry, even though they haven't got juiced yet. Um, he can really, he can really fly. And it's not a given that, um, it's not a given that I'm going to get much drone help. Packers just don't have speed. They don't have guys uh, with the high hit power. To you know, 
give give me numbers. Drops into the Matthews, the auto dive. That's that's rough. Not only was I out of position, but uh, the auto dive. I'm gonna have to get a lot. Ooh, Aubrey Matthews injured. No good. You hate to see it. Um. You know, I should have. Uh, I should have gone in there and put in Mel Gray, honestly. Like, I just, I think it's a friggin' uh, sham that they don't have Mel Gray in there. Obviously, he's, he's fast because he's a, a returner in the game, just like Johnny Bailey is is uh, a good, good running back because he's given 56 max speed. Because he... Oh, nice! And Barry Sanders, very underrated receiver. Um, I was trying to cover that that check down, but Pete got it in there. And actually, I think Pete is. I want to say Pete is thirty-eight speed, forty-four. Uh, what's it called? Pass control. So that was that was kind of impressive that he was able to slip that in there. All right, call play. Blown up. I'm just glad he didn't fumble. All right. So now my options are a little limited. Uh, I probably want to go past three or past four. I'm going to go past four. I'm feeling query on this one. In stride. I didn't want to test my luck. Just got out of bounds. Um, I'm gonna go back to pass two. Ooh, nice little block by. I guess it was it was it the tight end? Not sure who's up there. Ooh. Um, I think Jerry Ball almost getting in there. Using a blocker, cutting around, trying to get. Trying to get distance separation, but it didn't happen. And I may as well try to go for a reverse, you know. This is probably not going to be. Uh... Ah! <laughs> Alright, so this is a conundrum. Charles Wilson is hurt. Um, just too bad because he was my. He was my. He was in good condition. Um, so I'm going to put in West, uh, who's my starting tight end, but he's not even as good as my as this guy, Fontenot. So this is where it gets tricky. Hopefully, he'll only be out for one game, uh, so I can't take West out. But um, you know what? I'm gonna go ahead and say I can't. I'm gonna say I can't pass it to West. West can't get the ball. So, all right, where where should I put him? I'll put him at RB two. Yeah. So he's blocking, but I just I won't do that run play. And I'm actually gonna try this with Query now. I'm just feeling it. Um, ah. Yeah, I bum that one up. All right. So as far as I know. Harris with a diver, nice. So hey, Harris is is legal. <laughs> Ed West is not because he's the natural starter. Um, yeah, I didn't want an illegal guy at wide receiver two. It's just too too reliable. So Packers equalize. 
Uh, hopefully I can contain Barry this time. A really nice catch and run. Um, Barry, really underrated receiver. He's got 44 reception, which doesn't sound great, but with his speed... Oh, uh, I was just kind of hoping they weren't going to go up top. Or if they did, that uh, Cecil would be there. Of course he wasn't. Um, Alright, cutting through the D like a knife. Hoping to get some drone help. If I pushed him inside, didn't happen. Now I gotta go up. After a few seconds, Murphy is decently fast. He just, uh... You know, it takes him a while to get up to speed. So I'm still calling run one. Um, oh yeah! Cecil, there he is. Still calling run one. If they call run three, it's really hard to defend. Um, oh yeah! If they do a draw, I might get there in time. Run three will probably be a touchdown. Alright, I can probably... Alright, bad choice, bad choice. You know, that, but that's the computer. They're gonna... They're gonna give you some bad choices. And, uh... Timmy Tim Tims has a choice to knock it down. So that's not bad, giving up three points. I can live with that. I'll probably still be able to score at will. Two minutes left in the half. I should be able to punch in a tutter. Um, ooh, nice. It is time to check how people are feeling, though. Ed Weston good, but he's not legal. Quarian bad. Harrison bad. Fontenot. So he's 38-38. So, query slow. Harris, you know, not too... Not too sexy yet, tight end. But he's got a little bit of hitting power, so he should be able to to get some blocks. And uh, he can still catch, thankfully. Oh man, he's slow. I should have got out of bounds. Um, let's go ahead and give Fontenot a run. Um, Jerry Ball. Ooh. I almost broke it. I don't got much time though. I shouldn't have been dinking around so much maybe. Alright, is the timing there? Yes it is. I was a little afraid uh, Irvin. I think if, if it's Irvin or Blades up there. I'm a little afraid he was going to slap that one down, but I guess the timing was right. Alright, they got about one time for one play. Um, they probably won't be able to do anything. They are not smart enough. Ooh, Mel Gray! Ooh. Hate to see it. So even if I had put them in, they would have to edit their lineup. Ooh, Greer gets it. Murphy feeling slow. But uh, here comes the pack. Right, 14 10, got the lead. That great goal line stand. I'm not saying the whole drive was good defense, but got the goal line stand when it mattered. And uh, we'll be take we'll be receiving the ball. I should I should probably tighten up a little bit, try to make sure I don't. Um, you know, Dilly's in good. Uh oh, 54, 44. Also the speed boost. If you can call 19 ms a boost. Uh, Ed West not. What's the word? 
Not viable. Yeah. So, but Fontenot, so that, that doesn't look amazing. 50 44. I think that's kind of like uh, Troy Aikman, honestly. He might be 44 50. I don't know. But Font, or, uh, Dilly and Good, we, we want to go deep to. Uh, you want to go to Fontenot? Not a good arc that could have easily been picked. Um. Ooh, I was trying to get free. Heck, I'm gonna go run too. Oh, weird. They call it. That's weird. Uh, whatever. So, I should be able to scramble for this if I don't feel uh, confident. Yeah, 19 MS. It's not, it's not huge, but it's, that's where guys like Warren Moon and uh, Boomer Esiason, that's where they are an average in our 19 MS, and it is really nice. Like, it's subtle, but it is really nice to have that extra tick. You can really get around the defensive line a bit easier. So, even though that first long chuck didn't go, didn't go, that, that scramble felt really nice. That was, I felt in control. Um, so, James Wilder, the backup returner and I'm still bashing run one and oh 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 I wanted to house that badly I wanted to give that one to uh to Jerry Holmes because he is not gonna get uh many interceptions this year it's just not gonna happen oh Fontenot Fontenot Oh! All right, Thompson. Getting the tutter. Um, I honestly was feeling a, a run four with the fullback, but that's we got Eddie West there, and he's not viable. So with Daryl Thompson. Dead. So great defense. Uh, Jerry Holmes actually got his autograph. Uh, I think my dad was able to get that via the mail at one point. So, anyway. At least I didn't dive. There's the fumber. So. All right, Jerry Holmes, big day today. Fumble recovery, interception. Wow. Dilly still in good. You know we gotta go deep. Fontenot bad. Query bad. Harris bad. Okay, so. Dang man. So we're actually we're hucking and chucking to Thompson, even though he's he's 19. Uh, and that's fine, that's fine. I'm just glad I didn't throw it to West because he might have caught it. Um, we're chucking it to Thompson. Oh, and he's open. This this should be money. Um, you know when. When Dillwig is in good, especially in these early games before the uh, before the handicap kicks in, um, I'm, I'm going to be checking those deep with Dilly. I want to get those. I want to get those practices because um, you know. I want, I want to get those tutters when... Oh, good D. By myself. If I do say so myself. 
Oh, uh, when it gets challenging and I'm playing these high potent offenses, I'm gonna be able to go to the chat. Finally, called play Barry Sanders. And they're going for it. This will probably be a pass. Maybe a pass too. Nope. Oh, what a juke by Barry. So, all right. Not devastating. I mean, embarrassing, but. You know, that that's Barry gonna give it to you. I. Hold on, hold on. So the first two downs, I was able to shut down that run three by doing what I did on that play. But he had just enough space because on third down they did um, they did run one, which brought it to I'm gonna go past one. I haven't done it all season yet. First pick of the season for Dilly. It's not costly though, because this game is already in hand. Uh, first draw, the first run too that they, they selected. Yeah, when they when they begin to play on the bottom hash, that run three is not going to work for him. Ooh, that could have been picked. That was just off target. Ooh, nice catch. Um... I went ahead and gave him the bottom route, trying to slap down the top route. Um, Richard Johnson definitely could have caught a CC over me. He's got 75 receptions. Slow, but... Ooh, got him. Figured I would cover the two underneath guys and just hope that the timing wasn't there for top wide receiver. So big game for Barry. He really only had that one really long run. Other than that, I contained him pretty well. Um, a couple huge turnovers for Jerry Holmes for the Packers top cornerback. Dillwood going in the good. Um, didn't really. I wasn't really feeling what the jig is. I, uh, I'm gonna have to get my angles down a little better. Only 11 yards running. Uh, Fontenot did almost have a, a rushing touchdown. So I'm gonna go ahead and keep my lineup as is because. I want my wide receiver one to be, you know, the guy that's in good. Um, I don't want to completely neglect the run game, but it's just not, you know. Oh, Wilson does not come back, so Ed West is still at my fullback, which means I can't use run four and uh, can't pass to my. RB2. So, Buccaneers. As far as I know, uh, Haddix can JJ pick Dillwig. So, that's just something to think about. But, Haddix is so fast, usually he... Oh, missed the dive. Bad defense. Um, I knew he was going to run it. I just didn't get him on the angle. Hopefully that's the only big scramble that I give to Vinny. Ooh, bad throw. Oh, I thought I was going to pick that in stride. Those always look really pretty when that happens. 
They're letting Carrier go deep. Hopefully I'm able to slap this down. He can probably... Ooh. Yeah, I was locked on, but I was too deep. So, Carrier got it, not me. It's all good. Not really anything uh, I could have done to stop that unless I had... You know, blitzed. But... Yeah, obviously still would have been open. Wow. Someone was uh, just doing ferocious blocking. Incredible. Um, Alright, we'll start with the uh, pass four. Ooh, man. Just trying to slip in the pickle, didn't work. Let's go, let's slide on over to pass two. Ooh, double diver. Someone um, got up from that dive quick. So I actually haven't done a run one all season. It's time to bust it out. Query the lead blocker. And, uh, missed Majuke, so. Wasn't able to uh, get more than just the first. Alright. Not sure if. Ooh. <laughs> I tried to make him commit to the dive, and he did, but he had the angle on me. Alright. They were, uh, they were guarding the line like champs, so. Oh, ho, ho, ho. Hamilton can also, uh, JJ pick me. Apparently. But they're deep in their own end, their own end zone, so I'm not really scared. I mean, they could end up getting, uh, you know, if Vinny gets some time, he could, he could, like, like, uh, he could make something happen here. Ooh, like if he had, uh, that could have been a JJ. It wasn't, though, so they're going to kick to me. I'm going to get the heck out of bounds. I don't want to fumble this. That would be a uh, no bueno. Ooh, Bob Nelson almost getting in there. Return by Harris. Dillian good still. Fontano bad. Thompson average. Query average. Harris average. So. Uh, you know. Query is the dude right now. 31 max speed. 50 reception. Uh, we're still going to test. Uh, we're going to. Whoa! Okay. I tested Haddix. I lined it up. I feel like I did my work. Oh, nice chop block by freaking whoever that was. Maybe it was Harris. But Haddix got right up. He, he looks juiced, but I think it's just Haddix, you know? Whoa, terrible pass. So we are going to go ahead and go for it. Uh, pass for. They don't call it, which they don't. Um. Oh, a doinker. So that's bad luck. I, I was looking for Query because he has the receptions, but he was covered. And uh, Buccaneer is not doing great play call on here. We're punting it back again. I got no points. Two minutes left. Uh, I got to think about how I want to make this happen. So query. Oh, great fun. 
I need to get the frick out of bounds. So, Quarry's 3150. That was encouraging. Um. That was encouraging when Query got that JJ. Oh, I mean, he didn't get it, but. Um, you know, I lined it up. Probably do one more intermediate. Well, if they're gonna give me that, I'm gonna freaking. I might actually be satisfied with a field goal here, but I'll, I'll go. I'll go past one, and they're gonna give me query. Um, wow. Um, may as well go for it, you know. Haddock's is back there, but the timing is good. He doesn't jump, and it's pick. So, I felt like I did my part. Um, Scaling Charm definitely would have caught that, but that's not the game we're playing, is it? Bam. So, alright, I really need to tighten up. Scoreless first half. Um, I need to not get a turnover. I need to get a touchdown, even if it involves scrambling. Ed Weston Good is not viable. Yeah no. Um yeah. even though Thompson's just thirty eight nineteen I'm still gonna, still gonna try to feed him the ball. Scooting around, just, you know. I want to do run one, but I'm afraid uh, Haddix is gonna come in there and just destroy my life, so. Scramby scram five yards, not bad. Ah, well, <laughs> well, it was to West and he wasn't viable, so that's a good reminder that uh, that play that's a no no. I really should have scrambled. I had to scramble, but I was I was feeling uh what's the word? Um Man, I got no words today. I was feeling greedy, that's the word. And uh I saw a query open there. I didn't I could have scrambled. Touchdown passes are much more fun, what can I say? Um, Billy leading the Packers back in this. Um, if I have good coverage here, that'll bode well for me. The Buccaneers just, they don't have a great playbook. It's not the worst, but especially with when, since I'm committed to calling run one, um, that can cause some confusion. So I, I know what they're doing. Ooh. Oh, the triple dive. Thankfully, um, Holmes was there. I knew I had to get over there, but... Wow, they actually get three yards because I got caught up on a blocker. Maybe it was Cobb. Ooh, nice covered catch. And Vinny is looking... <laughs> Vinny is looking to Carrier. He sees him open there. That's that's hilarious. Carrier open again. 
I was, I was expecting that CC. Of course, I can't completely... Can't completely ignore the other guys because... If they're open, they're going to uh, catch them. All right, no more. Uh, no, they can't get a first down, so this is actually a decent position to be in for me. Um, got him with the diver. Oh, Bob Nelson doing the Lord's work. Great pass. Um, I didn't feel bad about that because Chuck Cecil was there, and he he could have he looked like he was in the line of fire. Um, I was comfortable guarding the bottom half of the screen, and you know, allowing nothing to to pass pass me. Um, that was this pretty dumb. Very little reward. Ooh, excellent dilly. The thing is, the thing is with his 19 reception, I'm afraid that if I line up If I line up a... Ooh! That was not smart, but I wanted to force it. I wanted to. If I line up a, a JJ opportunity... Oh, and that's some nice speed by Dilly. Oh, I wanted to... I wanted to house it. I really shouldn't mess around with runs, but... Uh, cause like that could have been a fumble, that could have been really costly, but you want to kind of pretend, you want to pretend you got options, right? Now I'm just going to stick with the, the pass four. Ooh, almost hugely costly but uh you know excellent dilly query lead blocker <clears throat> gets obliterated by the safety but Fontenot doing it now the pressure's on the defense um if I really really wanted to I could have tried to take more time off the clock but that's not the game we're playing we're um You know, Carrier really took it to me in the third period, but I'm confident that if I just keep calling run one, and I can, oh, and there, we got some coverage actually. Ooh, that could have been a huge pick. Um, Bob Nelson. I waited a little bit. I don't know why. Wanted to be dramatic. So huge third down here. Oh, big defense by Murphy. Oh, and they punted. Not smart, but you know what? If I if I was drunk and I uh, you know didn't feel like getting out of bounds, I could fumble it. Um, but I ain't gonna. So, really gotta be careful. Fumble sets up a, a Steve Christie field goal. So, gonna go with uh, the safe play. Oh! I was trying to take more time off the clock. Not smart. You really want to earn the victory with a tutter here. Excellent, Dilly. Might as well get out of bounds. Yeah, 
and uh, another pass for. Um, yeah, I'm going for it. I'm gonna go for the the dagger. Um, excellent, Dilly. We gotta we gotta trust him. Had he been covered, probably would have been picked. But I saw he had a free pass to the end zone, and that makes it eight points. So that's GG. You know, big defensive stop um, by the Packers, and not smart. Not a smart idea to punt it for the Bucks. They got one last chance, but it doesn't even really matter. I'm actually going to blitz with Murphy. Oh, Nelson blitzed. I almost got one with Murphy. I'm actually going to get a little more coffee after I simulate this one. And we'll do one more game for the night. This video is about an hour or so. So, 20 minutes more. So Dilly with some good, some good rushing, good scrambies, about seven yards of scramble. Vinny scrambling better. He had, he opened up the game with that great scramby. Uh, Dilly with two interceptions. I'm trying to remember. You know Hamilton got the JJ pick. Maybe I had one earlier in the game, I forget. Jackie Harris, huge game. Um, just getting open from that tight end position. And, yeah, great, great defense, domination by Packers. Um, all right, I'll be right back for week four. I got back just in time. The Packers might have had their, uh, their bye week. There's Charles Wilson. Well, I got another receiver. That's great. It means I got uh, my fourth run play back. So we're going against the Dolphins. Obviously, Marino, big threat. I'm still going to call. Run one the whole game. They're probably gonna get a lot of covered catches, but uh, you know that's chill. Logan, ooh, he's looking fast. He's looking juiced, honestly. So one thing about being Murphy the whole time is uh, when they do that play. <clears throat> but they do the pass. Uh, I'll know it'll be a play action. There we go. I know that's a play action, but I wasn't able to get over there because I just wasn't fast enough. Whereas if I was uh, Harris, oh, that's going to be a big gainer. Um, I accidentally got bumped. Um, here is the LB1 like people often are. Um. Oh yeah, Murphy. I saw him, what he was trying to do. Oh yeah, I was expecting that. Um, and Marino's got, he's got good speed, great speed actually. Um, so obviously I couldn't get there for that one, and it's it's hard to time 
getting under the ball for uh, past defenses. Um, especially with a slower guy like Murphy. Alright, so my starters are back in. That's BS. Let's just get everybody out. Okay. Um, now we check the... Ooh, still excellent. Alright. Fontenot bad. That's too bad. I really want to send him deep. I think we're going to open up with a pass four to Harris. And, you know... And that was, that was a bad play by me. At first I wanted to go Harris, and then I wanted to check down. I knew I had the speed to do it, but I just didn't line it up well. So that one's on me. Alright. They call the play, I'll try to slip it into Fontenelle. Had a vague feeling he was going to fumble that, but haven't really been uh, plagued by fumbles. Man. So I think I'm going to, I want a little bit better blocking. Fontenot just got wrecked on that play, so... Yeah, I'm going to sacrifice Harris. Not that he's like a threat, but... Dang! I was trying to avoid the rusher as well as... Man, I'm going to be bold. I'm going run one. Dang. All right, all right. Trying to avoid the rusher as well as get a time, JJ. Man, excellent Dilly connects it to Thompson. Um, let's go ahead and give Thompson a run too here. Maybe get a few yards. Ooh, I see uh, Offerdahl spying. But Harris holds the point. He does his job. Ooh. And I was greedy. I tried to give uh tried to give Wilson tried to get him the tutter. Um not smart though. Definitely not smart. What's funny is Query might have been actually fast enough to get around that. But uh You know, not Wilson, not 25 MS Wilson. Wow! Pretty surprised that I was able to get that, but you know what? Murphy might be in good. He might even be in excellent. Um, he doesn't feel like he's exactly zipping around, but if he's in good, he's 56 INT. If he's in excellent, he is in 63 INT. So, oh, yeah, we're going to go ahead and swap that back. Go ahead and do a run too. Ooh. I'm really glad he didn't dive. That could have been bad, but obviously still didn't do anything. Two minutes, we really want to tutter. Um Ooh, we got an open Fontenot. And a uh, an excellent Dilly is able to get that in there. An average or a bad dilly would that that ball would have been in the air forever. And um Ah dang. I tried to let it rip actually. 
We'll give Query one run. Ooh, and I see the, the cornerback two spying. <laughs> Alright, we're gonna try to get Query on this, uh, this JJ route here. Alright, ooh. Try not to scramble in for too many tutters, but that was definitely designed, especially with an excellent, an excellent dilly, 25 max speed. I mean, he's basically Mikowski, but he's better because he's got, you know, conventionally he's better because he's got a, a higher speed. Just 56. 56 speed, 50 um, control. Oh, but it's all the way back down to average. Wow, I didn't notice him even go to good. Okay, okay, okay. Bad, Thomas, that's chill. Ooh, bad and bad. We gotta go. Hmm. I'm gonna leave Query at tight end because the blocking is more important at the RB2 for my plays. Um, plus, from tight end, I, I can uh, send Query deep. Ooh, almost got the check down. I needed one more tap. Everyone's covered. Ready, down, put, 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 put. Fourth and three. We got wave us. And he might have dropped that, but I was just I was just freaking feeling it. Sometimes you just gotta go for it, you know. Run in the reverse. We got a couple stationary linemen, but someone blows through all that jazz. Going past one with the ah, <laughs> uh, mistapped. That's for dang sure. Pass four. It's like Query might have a shot. Ooh. Little surprised that he got that, honestly. Ooh, called play. Ooh, thankfully that wasn't fumbled. Alright, little time go down. Now go on run one. Ah, the blocking was not there. Maybe should have waited a little bit. Let's go ahead and be Darren. Let's be champions. And I'm trying to go for a time JJ. Ooh, got it. They call that garbage in the Tecmo community, but I was trying to do a timed situation. Trying to make him jump, he didn't jump, he dove, but the result was the same. Now I got a cushy lead. Uh, two score game. A nice four minute drive there for the Packers. Man, Logan is ripping. So. 
Probably not gonna get too much help. Definitely gotta cover deep. Unless they do the curls, then I'll, I'll tr try to trust my, my homies. Fourth down. That's good, because that means they might actually run it. They might do a run one, and what you'd be called... Oh, no, they don't. So they get the first, but that's chill. They're taking time. They're taking seconds. So I know that is a... Ooh, the diver is not fun. Um, super duper. Alright, this is a... This is a powerful play for Logan. Seven yards, tackled in bounds, I'll take it. I was expecting a CC. Nice defense by the Packers. They might run third and three. Oh, they do. Called play. Fourth and nine. This could be the game, folks. Oh! <laughs> Marino. Six max speed. I was just really lusty for the diver, so I went for it. Duper covered catch to be expected. Um, Dolphins can get a first down before getting a touchdown, and that's a factor here. Ooh, I tried to get under it. Um, I wasn't though, so. I didn't stick on Clayton because he could have got a covered catch. And uh, and had I stuck on him, then Marino might have checked it down. So, one point game. Definitely no room for error here. Don't. And as I take the kick, <laughs> checking the homies. Average. Bad. I should go. I'll go Wilson because he's got 13 hitting power versus Query's 6. I'm going to go ahead and be risky and do a pass one because if they call it, then it could be a fumble. And I just had to I just had to be patient. So they gotta call timeouts. Um, yeah, it really is time for me to not mess around. Ooh. I'm really thankful for Dilly. To Dilly for not um, I was just feeling that one. Oh, JJ pick. So uh, not smart. The um, dolphins could. Oh, and they pick curls. Big tackle. They really only need 20 yards to get a field goal. So this actually isn't looking good at all. Oh, and they're doing a play action. They're leaving Duper open or Clayton rather. They might even do a, a run play to get in the field goal range. Oh, they're doing curls. <laughs> so I opted to... Um, I opted to let them keep going because I knew they weren't going to go out of bounds because they're the computer. And I uh, gave him some more yards, and time ran out. So, you know, sucks for them. But uh, Dilwig, again, the leading rusher. 
I did give it an effort. I mean, I had nine other rushes for four yards. Um, still a solid game. He did have that pick at the end, but that was that was a calculated risk. I mean, I had uh, I had the, my guy going deep. He jumped for it. He didn't get it. Had I been um, losing, that would have been a really poor choice, but you know, I don't mind putting the impetus on my defense in that situation. Um, now, for the next video, I will be 4-0, and and the, you will we'll begin to see the handicap uh, come into play, for sure. Uh, on the other team and I really got to start being smarter uh, I really the, the risks have to be have to be more calculated this time are going forward um, and you know I just really gotta <laughs> uh, be sure I'm doing what I want to do and if I throw a pick into the end zone that it, it's really not going to come back and bite me. So, um, anyway, it felt good to go 4 0 tonight. Um, you know, I hope you guys see what I'm trying to do here using the backups. Um, it's kind of fun to, to take a familiar game, familiar team like the Packers to me, and uh, mix it up a little bit. Makes you see things that uh, maybe weren't on my radar all that much uh, before. So anyway, appreciate anyone who watched this, and I'll be doing another video for the channel soon um, in this series. So um, y'all have a great day. Catch you later.